This video is designed to help school staff develop a Tier 2 check-in and check-out system for their PBIS. To explain the process of their check-in and check-out system at Curtin, here is Ms. Kroll. As part of our um, check-in and check-out system through PBIS, I have a group of about four boys that come see me in the morning, and they bring back um, their folder, and we put a new goal-setting sheet in it for the day. We discuss what went well, what, what, well yesterday and then what we need to work on today. Um, they set a goal for how many points they think they can earn from their homeroom teachers. And then um, I give them a little positive reinforcement for remembering to come see me, and I give them one of our guru claws. Um, and then they go through their day, and I check in with them throughout the day if I see them in the hall and ask them, you know, how's it going? At the end of the day, they come back to me, and we total the points they earned, and we decide, you know, how if they met their goal according to what they set in the morning, or if they need to work on meeting their goal again tomorrow. They do a very quick reflection sheet that says what I did well and what I'm going to work on for tomorrow, and they take that second part home, get that signed, and bring it back the next day. Here are the Daily Progress Reports, or DPR, that Kurt uses. This one is for their Early Childhood Program. The form has the student name on it, the date, and the rubric for scoring the behavior. Students in Early Childhood receive a thumbs up or a thumbs down on each of the school-wide expectations at four natural breaks within the day. On the bottom, the teacher can leave comments and the student has a small reflection to complete. This DPR is used for elementary students and is just like the early childhood DPR, but instead of thumbs up and down, the student receives a score of 0, 1, or 2 on each of the school-wide expectations at natural breaks within the day. On the bottom, the teacher can leave comments and the student completes the reflection. This DPR is used for middle school and is just like the elementary DPR, but instead of at natural breaks in the schedule, the student receives a score after each of the transitions after every class. For example, after reading, math, and science. On the bottom, the student signs the form and leaves a short reflection. There are example forms available on the PBIS page of the MPS portal in the folder called Tier 2. For more information, please contact your PBIS external coach. Now, let's watch a student check in with his mentor. Armando? Mm -hmm. Did you bring your chart back? Yes, I did. Thank you. And Dad signed it? Mm -hmm. What did he say about you meeting your goal? He said that you're very proud of him. He should be. Are you proud? Mm hmm he should be. I'm going to away. Okay, so today's Thursday. And you do have a special list. So you have 56 total points that you can get today. Okay. How many points do you think would be reasonable to earn? 42. 42? We can go for 42. I think we had 38 yesterday, so that's pretty close. Okay, what class do you think you need to focus on the most today? Social studies. Social studies. focusing on social studies. Okay, do you have any questions? Give you a call. Thanks for being responsible and coming down. Thank you. Have a great day. Thank you. The student goes to their mentor at the start of the day and returns their signed DPR from the day before. The mentor goes over the coming day's schedule and makes sure the student is prepared. They work together and set a score goal for the day and discuss any potential problems the student might face. The mentor needs to be happy, excited, and positive throughout the process. The student then receives a new DPR that is put in their behavior folder. The student carries this behavior folder with their DPR in it with them the entire day and takes the DPR to their teachers throughout the day. Let's now watch a student check out with his mentor Dr. at the yeah, end of the day. Do you think you met your goal? Yes. Let's total it. And you did well in social studies. That was your focus. Nice job. Met your goal. 42 points today, just like you said you were going to get. Thanks for coming to see me and remembering. You're and you met your daily goal. What would you like your daily yeah. prize? Phone call home. Phone call home. Can you dial up Dad and I'll give him a phone call telling him about how you met your goal today? Okay. Go ahead. Students who meet their daily goal have their choice to receive a prize. Some prizes available include a cougar claw, five minutes of free time, 
five minutes on the computer, a good note home, a good phone call home, a high five from their mentor, or others decided by the student. Students who meet their goal every day for the entire week have the choice of a prize as well. Some of these prizes include 15 minutes of free time, 15 minutes on a computer, a good call or note home, a double high five from their mentor, or others decided by the student.